Hey, I'm Sudhir from Accio, and today I'll be walking you through Accio's AI data platform. Accio is built for marketers and agencies, making it easy to predict outcomes, optimize for any KPI, and even white label or embed our tools into your existing platform. So let's dive in. Let's walk through how you can quickly connect your client data and significantly speed up data preparation and transformation using natural language. Now to get started, um, we're going to start by pulling our client data. So I'm going to go ahead and create a new project. And in here, we have the ability to natively integrate and bring in data from different sources. So for example, if you want to bring in data from data warehouses like Google BigQuery or Snowflake, CRM such as Salesforce or HubSpot, um, or even Google Analytics 4. Now, once you have your data source selected and configured, we can go ahead and start analyzing our data. So what I'm going to do is open up a data set where I have already imported that marketing campaign data set. Now, this is a publicly available data set, it's a dummy data set. And we have information here, for example, about each campaign type, their placement, their device, the actual ad type, some time information, as well as information about the performance. So their spend, impressions, views, clicks, and conversions. Now, there's going to be some additional analysis that we're going to do. However, the first step is going to be cleaning that data, right? Preparing the data. Now, in this particular data set, it's already pretty clean, right? But if you wanted to do some lightweight data touches, such as you know, standardizing some of these date columns or removing unexpected nulls, we can do that really quickly using our data cleaner. It's an interactive tool where I can just select the options that I want, standardize, remove unexpected nulls, even flag and fill those outliers, and then I can apply it to my data set. Now, I'm not gonna do that here today because our data is already clean. However, there are a few other um, features or, or fields here that we need in order to ultimately achieve our, our, our goal of optimizing or predicting return on ad spend. And some of those are adding features like CPM or CPA or CTR based on our current metrics. And so to do that, we can achieve this using chat data prep and natural language. So over here, I'm going to go ahead and put in a prompt that we're going to add columns for CPM, CPC, CTR, CPA, and ROAS, and round them to the nearest third decimal. Really that simple. Now, what I'm going to do is a preview where it's going to take that prompt. It's going to go ahead and run that prompt as well as some of the metadata associated with our data set through our LLM. And it's going to give us an interpretation, right? What analysis is it going to do to the data? All right, so now we got our interpretation, right? So what this is doing is it's transforming our data set to add CTR, CPA, CPC, CPM, as well as ROAS, right? We can see a little preview of that data set here. If this looks good, we're gonna go ahead and apply and actually create a new view that has these additional metrics included. Okay, now that it's done, our data is ready, right? Our data is ready to now analyze our ROAS, our CPA, CTR, based on all the other um, you know, input variables and fields that we have in our data set. If we wanted to do anything else right, to make our data squeaky clean, we can, of course, use natural language and chat data prep to further, for example, filter, maybe bin our dates into certain time ranges, do any additional data cleaning we can achieve using natural language. In the next video, we will explore and visualize the data further in reports and dashboards with the goal of optimizing our return on ad spend. Thanks.